18650 lymphium ion cell I had one go bad it was reading zero volts and it would not charge and apparently they will not charge once they reach a certain voltage they just stop charging they basically cut out inside them it was like a little uh, switch or something so I wanted to play with one to see if I could make it you know charge back up and become good again and I successfully done that and before I make a video I never made a video I wanted to trial and error at first to see if it actually worked or not and there's the battery down there you can see it the silver one it doesn't have the paper on it mind you like these other ones do the coating still and I want to show you what it's reading it's charged and it's been charged for about six hours now just sitting here 3.88 charge back up and it's holding a charge and I put the uh, battery in a flashlight and the flashlight works real good so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually I don't have any more dead ones but when a dead one appears and the same thing happens to it I'm actually gonna make a video on how I did it and uh, it's pretty impressive I had to recustomize it a little bit you can see the end there it's just a screw head and some epoxy on the end to seal it back up but I kind of reworked the battery a little bit and um, well the next dead one I can come up with I'm actually going to make a video on how I did it pretty impressive so now this battery was no good now it's completely okay again the funny thing is is that the battery was good it's just what happened is that I left the flashlight on and the battery drained itself and it became too low in volts and then it became reading zero volts so it would no longer accept the charge or any of the above so I had to customize it a little bit and now it's accepting a charge beautifully and working just like it was before so thank you for watching and subscribe and stay tuned because there will be another video coming on of me actually doing this getting it back to life and being coming usable again well, thank you for watching.